For over a century, the Indian Army's mules have been their trusty companions in the treacherous Himalayas, carrying vital supplies to remote border posts. But that's set to end over the next couple of years. Cutting-edge AI-driven robotic mules and drones will now replace these reliable animals who have long provided last-mile connectivity to forward border posts, transporting heavy artillery and ammunition as well as general supplies, even along mountainous snowy routes, sub-zero temperatures and severe weather across the LSE with China and LOC with Pakistan. So how will autonomous robotic mules and drones strengthen the Indian Army? The Indian Army is the second largest active military force in the world with 1.4 million active duty personnel. It is also the largest volunteer army in the world. So how will the supply drones help reduce these numbers and streamline logistics? In 2023, COF No. 122, a six-year-old mule in Eastern Command in Tawang Sector in Arunachal, was awarded the Chief of Army Staff Commendation Medal. Hope number 122 transported over 6,500 kgs of ammunition over 750 kilometers at over 15,000 feet to help Indian forces track and face the PLA. But such deals on reliance on animals will soon be over. Indian Army has deals worth 320 crore rupees for hundreds of logistics drones in the pipeline. By 2025, the Indian Army will bid farewell to its animal transportation unit, replacing its mules with a fleet of high-tech logistics drones and robotic mules. The shift is part of the Army's force restructuring and optimization strategy aimed at reducing manpower by around 1 lakh by 2027. The Army has already reduced its fleet of mountain artillery mules by around 1,500 and plans to retire over 3,300 general service mules by the end of this decade. By 2030, the number of animal transportation companies across India is predicted to be reduced by around 70%. The new logistics drones and robotic mules will be able to operate in high-altitude areas, carrying supplies to troops stationed at remote outposts even over 10,000 feet. The drones will be able to fly over difficult terrain, while robotic mules will be able to navigate narrow paths and climb steep hills. The army has invested around 285 crore rupees for 100 four-legged robotic mules. It has also finalized a contract for 300 rough terrain vehicles, each capable of carrying over 100 kgs of supplies. A similar disbandment request had been made in 1999, right before the Kargil conflict with Pakistani attackers took control of the heights overlooking the National Highway 1, the sole motorable road during the Kargil War. The mules became crucial in making sure the soldiers on the front lines received the necessary supplies. Like the Indian Army, China's People's Liberation Army uses UAV swarms for logistical support, showing a broader regional trend towards the use of modern technology in military logistics. The future surely belongs to the force that successfully integrates modern tech with its frontline defense. Have your say, do the Indian Armed Forces need more AI-driven solutions to face the challenges of 21st century warfare? Leave a comment below and if you like this news report then subscribe to our channel or hit the like button so that it can reach more viewers.